Vlogging from the bathroom. Classes are done for the day. I'm so happy. So the story behind those chicken tenders was I bought them between my two back-to-back -back classes. And I was supposed to eat it during my last class. But I didn't get an opportunity to, so I was just smelling its goodness for an hour and 45 minutes. Just waiting to eat it and starving. So that's why I filmed those chicken tenders. There's nowhere to get smoothies near my dorm. So I've been settling way too often for iced coffee or frappuccinos. So this is a mocha, iced mocha. But when I get it, like all the mocha's at the bottom and then I have to stir it to get to this evenly colored drink. Is that how it always is? Or is it just cause this is the on-campus Starbucks and they don't try as hard? Cause yeah, I have to stir this for like a good five minutes just so the color evens out, and so the flavor evens out. Otherwise, all the flavorings at the bottom and the top taste like water. You may be wondering what I do when I'm not watching shows. I watch videos of shows on YouTube. Obsessed much? There are a lot of Broadway-related events going on today, all of which I'm gonna regret not going to, but I'm super tired. But yeah, I'm going through the interwebs and seeing everything that's going on tonight I was like should I? Should I just hop on the subway and go? Or should I just stay here and catch up on sleep since I didn't even wake up for my first class this morning and my first class was at 10.30 I woke up at like 11.30 and I was like oh crap So I'm watching Laura Michelle Kelly's Broadway.com vlog for Finding Neverland called Never Grow Up and she answered my question I'm getting really lucky with these Broadway.com Q&As, so like last time, here's the question that I asked, and here's the clip from the vlog where my question was answered. Janina asked, what do you guys usually do between shows on a Tuesday day? Oh, nails. I got my heels fixed on my shoes. I went to the bank and I got sushi. Not very glamorous. Sushi's probably a little bit glamorous.